Japanese researchers will begin a long-term survey of radioactive fallout in forests in Fukushima. They hope to discover the potential impact on humans. Researchers from the Japan Atomic Energy Agency plan to begin the survey later this month. It will cover forests within 20 kilometers of the damaged Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. Most of the area has been designated as a no-entry zone. The study will include rivers that collect spring water from underground. Researchers will measure the levels of radioactive cesium and other substances in soil and water for about 20 years. They hope to predict how the contaminants spread and their impact on human habitats. Japanese researchers are using an unmanned helicopter to measure radiation around the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. No detailed studies have been conducted so far as aircraft aren't allowed to fly within three kilometers of the facility. The survey started in Futaba town about two kilometers from the plant. The helicopter can cover a one-kilometer square area in two hours. It can fly over mountains and forests which are difficult to access. The drone flies at an altitude of between 30 to 100 meters, so it has the advantage of accurately determining the locations of so-called radiation hotspots. Data is transmitted to a computer and plotted on a color-coded map showing radiation levels. The researchers plan to compile a report by the end of the month.